Zwom. Bimo. Hey guys, Bimo back with another video all about typefaces and fonts. The term typeface and the term font are used interchangeably today, but why? They are two completely different things. Have you ever wondered if a font is the same thing as a typeface? Or is typeface just a term that is that historians and academics use all the time but really doesn't matter anymore? The simple answer is that yeah, they do have different meanings. But since the term font is so widely used and misused by the way, it doesn't really matter anymore unless you're a type designer, then it matters. If you're curious what the difference is, it's actually pretty simple. A typeface is a particular set of glyphs, an alphabet, and its corresponding accessories such as numerals and punctuation that share a common design. For example, Helvetica is a well-known typeface. A font is a particular set of glyphs within that typeface. And as you can see, as a creative, I can't help but play with these fonts, typefaces, and make cool designs. So let's move on. Uh, so a 12-point Helvetica is a font and a 10-point Helvetica is a separate font. The same goes for different weights. A 14-point Helvetica bold is different from a font that a 14-point Helvetica light. They are different fonts, but the same typeface, Helvetica. When typing a letter in Microsoft Word, however, or InDesign, it makes sense to use the term font since you're composing your document one font at a time, even if you use multiple fonts in that document. With desktop publishing, the general public was introduced to the term font rather than typeface. So most of you watching this video maybe don't even use the term typeface, but it became more or less synonymous with typeface font did. So, ah, you new designers out there, you want to use the word font when you really mean typeface. We traditional typeface snobs won't hold it against you. We understand. We, we understand. So, I hope this helped clear things up. This has been another BMO Creative video. Give it a thumbs up, like, subscribe, and we will see you in the next one. Thanks so much. Bye.